What's up, underdog? It's me, your boy Eric, and welcome back to the channel. We're actually going to ruin my dad's 2021 F-150. Okay. <laughs> So we're not actually going to ruin his brand new truck. This is a 2021 F-150 XLT with the 302A package. So it, it's close to being a Lariat, but not entirely. So you're not paying for the premium of having a Lariat, but you still have, you know, the 12 inch screen and you know, the nice amenities. What we're going to do with this beautiful lead foot right here is starting from here. So we're going to smoke the tail light, the Ford oval in the rear, plastic dip the EcoBoost, the tailpipe, the Fender F-150 emblem, and smoke out the front Ford oval. So here's the thing. He doesn't know that I'm going to be doing this to his truck. He's pretty clueless and he just got this truck like a month ago. It's, it's really mint, but here I am going to do what I do best, ruining cars. So let's start off by removing these huge taillights. Like these are like the biggest taillight I've ever had going to work with and I'm not going to be using a film. We're gonna use a VHD tint. I told myself I'm never ever going to use it, but I gotta because there's a lot of curves that goes with this uh, F-150 taillight and I'm just like, I'm not that competent to tint film this. So we're gonna do the VHD tint for the very first time in the channel and in my
ovals and I'm really surprised that it's actually really glossy right off the bat and we're going to finish them with clear coats after three or four coats of VHT tint I will be removing the masking tapes I'm really surprised how uh, clean those lines are And before I put clear coat, I'm going to do another 2000 grit wet sand just to uh, get those imperfections uh, leveled. And we're going to do two coats of clear coat. Once they're dry, just put them back in. Just reverse of how you took them out. Put them back in and, and reinstall those 10 and 8 mil bolts. We're not done yet with wet sanding. I'm going to do another wet sand on top of the clear coat. Why? Well, we're going to polish it. I'm using Meguiar Scratch X 2.0. This is definitely not the right way to polish this because I have no idea of what I'm doing. <laughs> and to be fair, this is actually my first time polishing taillights or polishing at all, actually. So after this uh, monstrosity of uh, whatever the hell I'm doing, I'm going to buff it out with a microfiber towel. Well, Eric, why are we doing this? Well, to make it look like it's made professionally. So you will see the difference from this to this VHD tint uh, taillight that you usually see on DIYs. And before I forget, I'm going to put all the decals necessary. I actually custom made this for him. I had to find a proper font for it. I actually forgot to finish the vlog, so I didn't get any reaction clips of my dad seeing the truck, but by the looks of it, he's actually really, really proud of it. That's what he wanted, you know, the blacked out Leadfoot F-150. It costs me less than a hundred bucks to actually pull that off. I mean, if you learned anything from that video, hit the thumbs up, and if you haven't subscribed yet, you know what to do? It's free subscribe and hit the notification bell so you know you get notified when i'm going to do another of those videos so i'll see you again on the next episode take it easy folks Bye.